Since roughly a third of all our FAQs are about masks, today we're going to take a closer look at a few of the most common questions that we get about them. The most important factors when deciding which mask is best for you are how well does it seal around the face and what type of filtration does it use. Some of the most common masks that we find are cloth masks like these. Now they won't have a real tight seal around the face like these will. Any of these respirators typically have a rubber gasket or some sort of seal that prevents air from leaking around the face and nose. With the cloth mask, the seal isn't as tight around the face, so there may be some air leakage. First question you really need to ask yourself is, do I need to focus on particle filtration or particle and chemical slash smoke filtration? For smoke, fragrances, odors, anything along those lines, you're looking for a mask that has at least some activated carbon in it. This mask has activated carbon, not a lot, but some that you can actually visibly see from the outside of the mask. You can also see activated carbon in the filters here. These filters are for the Respro mask. They fit the Allergy or Aero mask, as well as the Respro Techno and Sports stuff. And for some, particularly respirators, half masks, you can buy specialized canisters that focus more specifically on organic vapors, compounds, and certain fragrances or solvents that you may encounter. As a staple filter type for any mask, particle filtration is usually what most people are looking for. Now all of these masks offer varying levels of particle filtration. The most common type is just a type of fabric filter like you see here, here, or here. And then you have more advanced like these where you, they actually offer HEPA filtration. All of them work to capture particles like pollen, dust, dander, things along those lines. So to wrap up, for most asthma and allergy sufferers, you're going to be looking for particle filtration which you can find in really any of these masks. For those that are concerned with smoke, chemical solvents, chemical vapors, any sort of uh, gaseous pollutants or things like that, you have to look for something that's a little more specialized, that features the carbon, as well as something that seals a little better around the face. Thank you for checking it out, and thank you for visiting at chewallergy.com.